Yasin asks, uh, I'm from Palestine where gay marriage is not legal. Can I still get a fiance visa to the USA? Um, you know, we process quite a few same sex applications and, um, you know, uh, the government, since they passed DOMA, um, you can definitely uh, file for the fiance visa. But uh, just a disclaimer, um, we work with over 174 countries and uh, we do not uh, we're not familiar with all the laws in every single country and we are aware of the fact that it, it can be dangerous in some countries um, you know pursuing uh, a same-sex relationship or marriage uh, so it would behoove you to you know do a little research on your own in, in your own country um, just to make sure that you're not going to be in any danger because I would hate to tell you that um, yeah you can process your fiance visa um, there in that in where is it Palestine in that particular country and then put you in any you know harm's way or in any danger or anything um, but I can tell you as far as the the USCIS and the Department of State Department of Homeland Security uh, you can definitely file um, for a fiance visa now if it's too dangerous for you to do it there um, they do also have a process um, you know at the Department of State where you can request a transfer of your case or petition you would have to write a written statement um, stating that uh, why you were, felt you were in danger or in harm's way and uh, they would make a decision on uh, where to transfer that case to uh, if you are aware of a particular embassy uh, near you that is probably more friendly um, to this type of case, uh, you may even request uh, that embassy. But uh, again, um, you know, as a disclaimer, uh, please do your research. I mean, we've successfully processed over 35,000 petitions, and we've processed quite a few same-sex uh, petitions. Uh, but there's no way we can know every single law out there for every country. Um, so, so just make sure you check that out on your own. If you found this video useful, it would mean a lot to us if you could hit the like button and comment below to let us know what you think. You can also ask your own immigration questions in the comments below. If you want to make sure not to miss any of our future videos, we invite you to subscribe here on YouTube and be sure to click the notification icon so you can be alerted whenever we publish a new video. Also, don't forget to follow us on Facebook where you can watch our regular immigration Q&A live streams.